All right. No, not yet. So, this is R, all right, which is exercise 2F. Now, it's got this stupid fancy name called Pearson's Product Moment Correlation Coefficient. All right, and you don't even get told how to calculate it till the next exercise in 2G. But what does it mean? Okay, when we were talking scatter plots, you guys had a pretty good understanding. You can't quite see them, they're a bit blurry. Let's see if it'll focus them. There you go. Sorry? Oh, the light off that. Okay. Alright. So, what sort of relationship? Positive. So, positive. Strong. All right, and we'll just stick with linear for now because this is only used for linear ones. All right, what sort of relationship? Is that better? Yeah, moderate. So moderate. And it's still positive. And this one? No. All right, no relationship. So you guys have got a pretty good understanding of what that means. All that this R thing does... is put a number to it, okay? And this first exercise, exercise 2F, is all just about guessing. As stupid as that might sound, all you have to do is say, it's about this, on somewhere between this scale, okay? So this only ever is between negative 1 and 1. Okay? No, it's there. No, no. On the, oh, sorry, on that one. Thanks. So, any area in between here is no relation. Okay? So, if there's no relation, you would say that that is around somewhere between... Oh, that one's really, really no relation. So, I would say that that was zero. The R value for that, the Pearson's product moment correlation coefficient, all right, R is zero. So, between here and here is strong, okay, and the same on this side, okay. The difference is in what, though? Positive. Right, one's positive, one's negative. So, it doesn't matter which one it is. You would say that this probably had a correlation coefficient, all right, Pearson's product moment correlation coefficient, R equals approximately... Let's go 0.8. Okay. In between the 0.5 and 0.7 is moderate, which leaves what between 0.25 and 0.5? All right. That's all this exercise is, guys. That's how easy it is. You come across a graph and you say, well, that's a moderate one, so that's, let's say that one is probably at positive, so let's say it's about 0.6. Alright, R is approximately 0.6. That's all 2F is. Easy enough? Yeah. I reckon you guys can do that one easy.